Hi everyone, my name is Julie. I apologize for the lighting. It is so dark and rainy out. We actually have a flood warning in the area, so it is going to be a little bit weird lighting today, but we will power through. I am here to give you my February update. Well, I guess whatever I used in February, it's technically a March update. Is it? <laughs> I don't know. It's March. It's going up in March. Um, for my lip product use up, you guys know I put 36 products in this project and they're a mix of full size and travel size minis you know things like that to use up on my lips so I have really good progress I was hoping to show you an empty you will see that I got really close <laughs> to showing you an empty I'm not gonna be showing you all 36 products because I didn't use all 36 but I'm going to show you the six that I did use and also I did make a decision on one and that is going to be my first declutter of the year this is not a surprise if you saw any of my last two videos, <laughs> but I am going to get rid of the Buxom Tease lipstick. I tested this in my Project Fling, like Spring Fling um, Project Pan, and I just hate this color. To be honest with you, it makes me look dead. It's too Barbie pink, like baby pink, uh, to really look good on me. I really look better in mauves. So this one I'm going to give to a good friend. Hopefully they love it. It is what it is on that one. Also in the same spring fling, I did use this L'Oreal Pop Balm. I don't unfortunately have any way to show you progress on it yet. I didn't use it enough for that, but you can see I did use it a little bit. Um, this is one I'm definitely going to start focusing on more. I was hoping that I would finish up my Nearly Empty and then move on to this one, but I didn't finish up my Nearly Empty, so it's still here. And that one is my Fresh Lip Balm. This is in the shade Rosé. You can see there, I was there last month. I am now there. I have very little left <laughs> on this one. Like, that's not even a nubbin. That's like five uses and this will be gone. So I almost got to the end on it. This is clearly gonna be my first empty, but it didn't quite happen for this particular update. So hopefully this empty will be like strong and <laughs> I'll finish that very fast and then I can move on to that L'Oreal Pop Balm. The L'Oreal Pop Balm just isn't as moisturizing. I do have it on my lips today, but it's just not as moisturizing as I was kind of hoping for. But that it is what it is, right? It's just your standard lipstick, a sheer lipstick. So I just gotta keep that in mind. A balm that I do really like and I've got some pretty good progress on is my Buxom one. You guys know this was brand new when we started. I've already taken off the dome last month. That is what we have now. So not too much of a different from last month, but let me show you what it is on the paper because it is progress. That's a progress right there. This is, it's a really actually a, a hard balm to go through. Like I thought it'd be really fast. I could like knock it out, but it is taking some time. So I like it. I'm still really enjoying using it. So that's great for me. Um, this is probably 15 uses, maybe 10 to 15 uses in the month. So like I've got a lot more life still in that product. I'm really glad I bought those. Um, I'm interested to try the other colors. <laughs> All right, let's talk about the lipstick. This is the Lancome Color Design Sugared Maple, and it's in the sheen. I love this lipstick. I don't know why I love it so much, but I absolutely adore it. That is what I've got left you can see it's gone down a little bit. I'll show you on the paper too. It's gone down a little bit. This one always takes time. I love it. I wear it frequently. I basically trade it off with this one. Um, it's like my, I'm going out of the house lip product and I don't care if it gets on a mask, like it washes off easily because that's not something we need to think about. And that one is right here. So I do have progress. It's just a little bit each month, and that's okay. This is one that I can continue working on. Um, I foresee myself, side note, rolling some of these colors out and then bringing in some summer colors in a little bit. I do have some spring colors, but some of these I'm definitely not going to want to wear, you know, April <laughs> time period. So we're just going to continue working on that. Is it there? So progress, yes. Done, no. The last one... I'm going to show you on the paper first because I've got it in my hands. This is my nude sticks. So I started there. That was last month, and that is this month. So really good progress on there, like a full space each time, which is awesome. This is my nude stick. It's in the shape Ripe. 
So you can see I probably have two months ish still on here, maybe a little more, maybe a little less, but about eight weeks. It's just a little nubbin of a thing now. This is a nubbin. This is clearly a nubbin. And I was kind of hoping to get maybe a little bit more progress on it, but I was focused on a few other things and I got distracted, like just continuing using the lipstick and continue using the other lip balms. So this one didn't make it in the top, but I'm going to really focus on it. I'm only really using what five lip products at the moment. So it's easy for me to rotate through them. It's just, I got to make sure that I'm using each one evenly as opposed to playing favorites. But when this sugar lip balm is gone, I know I'm going to start using some of these other ones more. And that's it. It's like a short and sweet update. I didn't use too many colors this month and that's okay. Just want to get some good start, like some good momentum leading through my 2021 projects. So I think I did pretty good here. I'm glad I had my first declutter. Uh, yeah, that's where we're at. Thank you so much for watching. You have a great rest of your day. Happy panning and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.